What's up guys, today we're going to be doing a tutorial on the plugin called Mega Crates. So this is a really awesome crates plugin, it has a lot of features to it. There can be keys for this plugin, your players can get crates, and then open them up, and then there's a little animation that scrolls through all the possible items they can get, and you can obviously have chances to pull, like a certain item, maybe a diamond, you want to have a lower percent of chance to get that item. There's a ton of things that you can change. You can also add regions to where this only works in, so that's pretty cool, as well as you can edit all of this in-game, like what's inside the crate, and everything like that. And your players can also get crates from mining. But you can also just place these around your spawn and then give your players some keys to use. Maybe from a special promotion or just Christmas time you want to give out some keys to your players. Or maybe even put it in a kit that your players can get or like a perk. Anyways, let's go ahead and get started. What you want to do is you want to download three plugins for this to work. It's a script, so you're going to have to download script and then two other script plugins. Install that on your server, restart your server, and then download this actual plugin which goes inside the scripts folder so then that should work out perfectly anyways let's go ahead and get started by typing the command slash crate all right so there we go these are the possible commands that we can use first things first we're gonna have to create create a crate so slash crate create and then let's give it a name i'm gonna just call this hub so this is a crate that is you know it's only gonna work in the hub so we're gonna hit enter so crate named hub has been created and you can do anything you can do like prison or maybe a weapons crate something like that next thing you want to do is you want to add items to the crate so hold the item in your hand type crate add item and then the crate name that we just created so hub and then the chance so let's go with let's go for the diamond 20 percent chance to pull this if you want a custom name for this item you can type yes if you don't then you can just type no if you type yes then you can just type in the custom name right there but we're going to go with no hit enter there we go so we just added that one let's go ahead and add this one so slash crate add item crate name and then let's go with let's go with 30 and then no so obviously you know the diamond's gonna have a less percentage to get pulled and then a stick's gonna have a high one so for the stick let's go with 50 percent hit enter so there we go we just added these three items with their certain percentages so let's say you have a region selected let's say you have a region like this is the hub and we have this region selected and we added it with world guard so you can add that region to where the crates generate only inside it with slash crate add region and then the region name so that's how that works but we're going to go ahead and place the crate that we created with slash crate place and then the crate name hub and hit enter there we go the crate was successfully set so it actually spawns where you're looking at kind of didn't want it there but that's okay and then the next thing we're gonna have to give our players keys so like I said in any sort of way that you want to do that maybe a holiday or a promotion the way that you do that is with the command slash crate give and then the crate name and then the player name so just like that we've added a hub key to our account so this can also work with bycraft so you can use this based on the certain things that they buy so when we right click on this okay so we have to switch to survival mode first but when we right click on this it's going to open up this little gui so open crate or cancel let's go ahead and click open and now this awesome little animation pops up but we got the stick at the end so that was a sick animation really really cool your players are going to love that animation and just have fun with these crates so keep in mind when you add the region with slash crate add region your players after mining will start to see that there are crates being generated right in front of them so it's just tested after you know mining a certain amount of blocks then a crate will pop up anyways guys that is pretty much it for this plugin tutorial hopefully you guys did enjoy you can create endless amounts of crates and yeah your players can just have fun with it so hopefully you guys did enjoy if you did make sure to drop a like subscribe for more and i'll see you guys in my next video peace out